Um, yeah, I want to present um, a hobby project. A uh, hobby means always uh, when there's not so busy time, uh, we work on this, but unfortunately this didn't happen in the last 12 months. So there's not much, not much progress at the moment. Um, but the idea is all, many here are developers, so we're always sitting inside on our desk and don't go out. But a lot of business is actually outside. People have to move from place to place and um, yeah, we thought um, we could put support this kind of business a little bit. Uh, for example, for customer services uh, who have to visit the customers and uh, op optimize business processes, um, integrate service workflows and um, make, um, make the life for these uh, people just easier and make the service quality better. So there are many, many cases. Um, there are um, people checking stuff in the park or uh, on kids playgrounds. Um, there are a lot of um, abandoned houses in Japan that uh, nobody knows where they are and how many they are. Um, there are broken benches. Um, there are lights that don't work. Um, there's grass that nobody cuts. And uh, streets that are not well maintained. And there are like, lots of um, people who have like, emergency cars or pick up delivery of um, uh, seniors um, or security services, there's just, just a lot of them, or um, this is patrol car um, for the highway, um, or people checking things, doing field work. So they have to go out every day, and um, I think a lot of them don't use much um, IT, a lot of um, manual work. So we thought there are applications like C Click Fix and Fix My Street and all these things, but they are always missing something. Um, and so we thought, yeah, actually, um, um, in our daily business, we use Redmine um, every day. It's an issue tracker. Um, but um, wouldn't it also be useful, actually, for people doing field work? And um, we figured out that uh, Redmine would actually work for them if they would understand what it is. So the words there are very much for developers. And it doesn't contain any geographic information. Um, so we extended Redmine in that way, that it knows points, polygons, and lines. And we try to use their open source technologies. Uh, it's Redmine is open source, PostJS is integrated, and we try to implement uh, standards like KML output. Or, um, yeah, it, it's work in progress. So um, the nice thing on uh, Redmine is um, the, the workflow. So, a workflow is usually you create a ticket. I don't want to go into detail so much. You create a ticket, um, then somebody has to review it, and maybe uh, modify it, edit it, and um, then somebody resolves it, and then you close it, and then we can see it's done. Um, so if there's a time, I will show later a demo. Um, that's, that's one part, and uh, Currently, there's a second part we are working on, and um, this is if somebody goes out and goes to, to resolve these reports, um, we want to provide uh, some tool to make it easier for them and to make it faster. So we want to add tour planning. So first, we collect all these reports, and then we optimize them. And we want to find the best schedule and the route to visit and complete all these tasks. And um, uh, the idea is uh, to use VLP algorithms um, implemented and currently in the develop branch of PG Routing. Um, so PG Routing uh, works in the database and uh, you just have a list of uh, reports or orders and a, a selection of vehicles and a distance matrix and with this you try, try to create uh, the optimum schedule that people uh, can, go, can go home to their families early. So. Um, and there's something um, uh, actually new coming in the next ne one or in two months maybe. Um, so we are currently implementing a better VRP al algorithm for garbage collection. That's um, if you have to pick up containers. So you, you, uh, it supports multiple depots, so you can start at mul multiple places. And um, you have predefined start and ending sites. 
and uh, it has uh, time window constraints and uh, capacity constraints and it also supports the uh, dump or disposal site so you, you fill your truck until it's uh, completed and then you drive somewhere and empty it and then you come back and you do that for um, your whole uh, fleet of vehicles and something we create for that is called uh, VRP Tools it's a C++ class library and uh, this will be then um, wrapped with PG booting. And currently everything is a bit split in different repositories, but um, I think in a month or two um, we will have it ready uh, to be tested on GitHub. And um, hopefully then if we have not so much work and not so many projects, hopefully then we will also be able to work to get this into this uh, report tracker. Um, and if you want to keep up to date or if you have more questions, you just ask me uh, this evening at the party or coffee break or you send me an email or tweet. Um, I can show you a quick demo. So this is how um, Redmond looks like. Um, there's not much change. So we have extended the project itself by um, a project area. So you, you can, construct, you can um, restrict this to, to a certain area. And uh, also as a, as a user, you, hopefully there's internet now. As a user, you have a point. So you could actually update this point um, that you can track this person. And I think internet is not so good here. So, yeah, I can show it later if somebody's interested. Well, let's take the slides here. So, in the reports, you have a, a map window. So you have a list of a list of uh, reports here. Um, when you have opened one report, you can. Um, change things and it's uh, tracked in the history so you know what happened with this report um, if you create a report you can um, specify priority who is assigned, due dates, start dates uh, how much time it takes um, it's possible to add custom attributes um, that's actually a default feature of Redmine so we don't have to do anything there and you can draw here um, three types of geometries, either points or if you have to cut the green in the park, you can also draw a polygon. Yeah. And there are a lot of, lot of possibilities to, to actually um, configure your installation with permission systems that uh, take some time to understand, actually. Yeah, and with the VIP um, solver, Um, it creates a, a distance matrix, and uh, for that I have to say we're not using PG routing, so we are using uh, open, street map, uh, open source routing machine because it's much, much faster. And um, yeah, hopefully this demo works now, but I hope the garbage collection one um, is even working better. So the idea is that it works like you have uh, a sample data, you have a list of vehicles with a capacity, um, you have a single depot at the moment where you can start, and you have a list of orders, and when you, when you start the scheduler and the internet is working, okay. well I will, I will show it later anyone who is interested. Um, and I think that's enough now for the break, to have a coffee break. Any, any questions?
あのすみません、いいあのすごく面白いツールだと思うんですけど、あのレッドマイン自体がプログラマー向けのツールなので、なんてでしょう、そのワークフローの管理っていうのがビジネスマンに理解できるのかなっていうところが、あの多分言葉言葉の問題と思いますから、あの最初そのそのあのトランスレーションファイルを取って、ね、意思は普通の人わからない。あ医師はあのレポートに変更しましたよ。あ,あとあの、マイストンは誰もわからない。ですから、マイストン代わりにカンペーンという。とか、多分言葉の変更するとあの、まあ、みんなわかると思いますし、まあ、今のレッドマインのちょっとむず、まあ多分ディベロッパーには難しい使、使いにくいと思いますから、よく使おうと問題ないですけど、あの最初はちょっと時間がかかりますから、あの結構あのあのいい API がありますからあの API であの簡単なあシンプルなツールであの作るつもりです。はい見せていただいているのは、そのえっ、ー、とまあそのタスクの優先順位とか決め決める感じのそのえっ、ー、と要はその実際に作業される場所じゃないところで見てるようなイメージがあるんですけど、実際そのえっ、ー、とこの位置で何何をするっていうタスクを持っている人がそのモバイルデバイスでどういう感じでこうタスクの状況が見えるのかなっていうのをサンプルみたいなのがあれば見てみたいなと思ったんですけど。そうサ,ンサンプルアプリケーション一回あの簡単なアプリケーション作りましたけどあの iOS だけ<笑>サンプルアプリケーションですけどあのそれは今あの、まあ、時間がないですからあのファンディングがないですからあの今作ってあの、まあ、ペンディングペンディングですけどそのことをするつもりで、まあ、自由パパ活でも使えるかなとか<笑>あのそう登録は問題ないですけどあとそのシンクロナイゼーションは多分ちょっと。いうパパがついできるかどうかわからない。うん、わかります。あの、A、API あの Redmi API と今とジオジオインフォメーションの API もありますから、他のソフトでもなんかインテグレーションができると思います。一応でもその全体のエコシステムの中には考慮されているという。はい、多分あの,あの今持ってる持ってるシステムにインテグレーションするのは。するかもしれないです。ごめんなさい。ええー、それではいいですか、皆さん。うん。ありがとうございます。じゃあ、えっ、ー、とですね、ええー、と、切り替えさせていただいて、ええー、記者がくってですね。<笑>ええ。